the best supplement for your productivity is nothing. Why are you looking for a pill to do your work for you? Unless you want to take stimulants, I mean, that would solve the problem, but it's probably not a good idea. Now look, I've got ADHD and my productivity is looky kind of trash, but it's still way better than it used to be. And that's because of these tips that I'm about to share with you. Tip number one, diet. Now look, I'm not a scientist. I'm just a 17 year old who hates doing his schoolwork and wants to get it done as quick as possible. And something I've noticed is that my diet affects my productivity so much. Like if I wake up and eat some, I don't know, even some simple foods like just bread, it doesn't even need to be unhealthy stuff, but just processed unnatural foods affect my diet so much. But I've also noticed that when I wake up and I eat stuff like meat or cheese or eggs, it doesn't really have an effect at all. But if you really think about it, it does make sense. Like when you eat food, it's giving you energies like calories. Not all calories are the same though, because there's different shit that makes up the calories like sugar, fats, different types of fats, you know, whatever. So they're not all the same and energy, you know, when you eat the food, it's what gives you the energy, which is what makes your brain work, which is what makes you productive, right? So if you're eating all these shit foods, you're basically giving your brain shit energy, which makes you shit productivity. Tip number two, pretty similar to tip number one. And that is hydration. Nobody understands how important water really is. I don't have any water left because I drank it all because I'm hydrated. If you're not drinking enough water, you're not going to be productive. There's a reason that you could, that they say uh, you can only live like three or seven days without water. I don't know. Look, I don't know the science behind it, but in my personal experience as someone who hates doing their work, like hates doing work they don't want to do when I'm hydrated, it's just so much easier to do and get done. But when I'm dehydrated, I just don't want to do shit. You don't need to drink crazy amounts, just three to four liters a day. It's not really that hard. That'll increase your productivity way more. Give it a try and let me know how it goes. Tip number three, you've probably heard of this one before and it's called eat the frog. Now don't go hunting frogs and eating them because you'll die and the frog will die too. And you know, that's not, that's not fun. You know, we don't like to die. But eat the frog is actually a metaphor. So let's say you have a food, like you've got a plate of food, you know, you've got, you've got your favorite foods, you know, you've got whatever processed shit you like eating. You've got uh, maybe some not that processed shit that's pretty good. And you've got a frog. Now, obviously you don't want to eat the frog, but if you eat the frog first, it'll be done. And, you know, it'll be over with. You won't have to eat it ever again. And you can go and eat the good, the food that tastes nice. It's like that with your work too. If you wake up and get your shit done first thing in the morning, you'll have the rest of the day chilling and the rest of the day will be fine. But if you if you wake up and just chill in the morning and then think, oh, I'm just gonna do my work later, it's gonna be so much harder to actually start. You're gonna be like, oh, I don't wanna do this. I wanna just keep chilling because that's what I've done all day and it's been fun. I know this because I've done it in my part, in my experience too. That's why now I try to do all my work in the morning, but because of school, I can't really do that. So the problem is school is literally making it so I can't do my schoolwork. Now, don't be tempted if you like, let's say you want to go take a shit in the morning. I do that too. I take, I take shits every single morning, but something I used to do is watch Instagram reels on my phone while I was taking a shit. I used to do that every day. Sometimes I'm gonna be honest. Sometimes I still do. If you just do some stupid shit, like if you beat your meat or eat some junk food, any bad habits, like anything that isn't like, you know, just normal shit in the morning, like brushing your teeth. If you do any of that before doing your work, before they eat the frog, it'll make it so much harder. So try and just do your work as fast as you can in the morning. Meditate is another productivity hack, which I'm not going to talk about too much because I've already talked about a bunch. I've got some meditation videos linked up here. If I remember to put the card, so go ahead and watch them. Tip number four, and that is caring about your work. Now I know this is easier said than done, especially if it's schoolwork. Now let's say you've got an English assignment and you hate English because English sucks and everyone hates it. You're obviously not going to care about the actual thing. You won't be passionate about it. But if you convince yourself that you do care about it, it'll get better. Now, this is pretty tricky to do. I'm going to be honest. I've done it in the past. I like convince yourself that you want to do a good job on whatever work this is and that you really care about it. And that'll make it easier to work on. Even if you don't actually care, just tell your, just keep telling yourself that you do. And I don't know if it's like placebo. I'm, I don't know the science behind it, but it fucking works. So try it. And last but certainly not least tip number five, and that's thinking about the future thinking about the fact that you're doing delayed gratification, basically thinking about, yes, doing this work is trash right now. And I hate it because it's boring, but when it's done, it's done. 
Now, recently I had an assignment for school for like geography. We had to do this super long report. Anyone who goes to an IB school, you know what an IA is. You know what I'm talking about, it's trash. What I did while I was working on it, I just thought, all right, if I do this now, I can just chill out tomorrow and it'll be, it'll be all fine. So I just, I kept doing that. And whenever I wanted to stop working, whenever I was getting lazy, I just thought, all right, you have to do this now because then you don't have to do it later. Just keep thinking about you have to do it now because then you don't have to do it later. And that helps a ton. I'm, I'm telling you, it, I don't know the science again, but it works. So try it. If you found any of these tips helpful, then please be sure to leave a like, subscribe and turn on notifications and leave a comment down below just to say hello. You know, I want to say hello to you guys. So say hello. That's all I have for today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.